good afternoon everybody and welcome to Pinox Smart Home Installation. If you're new to this channel, please to like and subscribe and please to follow me on all my social media platform. Links are in the description. So right in front of me guys, I have a IP camera. This IP camera uses memory card, right? I want to do a full review on this camera. But over this evening, I'm going to show you the two ways how to connect your IP camera to the internet. There are two ways. There are the Wi-Fi method by using Wi-Fi and we have the LAN method meaning we're going to use a cable from our modem to connect to the camera to the internet so we can have access to our phone. Alright so first of all this is the power port. This is the reset button sorry. There's a button inside of this so you can actually reset the camera this is your network port and this one is your power port so your power port your LAN port and your reset button all right so we're going to connect the camera to the Wi-Fi so we're going to put power to the IP camera so this is your 12 volt socket DC so I'm going to plug this in this and there's a light on the network port to show you um, that there's power in the IP camera. Alright, so let us connect the camera by using the Wi-Fi first. Alright, let us go to that right now. So we're in the app right now and uh, let me show you the app. Let me show the app. This is the app EC Cloud. So we'll go into the app, waiting for it to load, and then we're gonna select add smart device. Then we're gonna scan the QR code at the bottom of the camera. Alright. Then select add. And we are waiting for it to load. Alright, so we are going to connect. Then we are... So we are going to select the hotspot for the camera. So the camera has its own Wi-Fi. So this what you are seeing on the screen is the Wi-Fi hotspot from the camera and all right we're just waiting for that then we're gonna go back so down the bottom we have direct connection direct connection means direct connection means that we can actually connect the um, the phone directly to the camera's Wi-Fi right but we don't want to do that so we want to remote view when we select remote view we're going to put in the Wi-Fi password of the modem right let me clear that and add in the Wi-Fi password all right so I just add in my Wi-Fi password then I'm going to select confirm. So we have so we're waiting for the camera to connect to the modem. That's their host Wi-Fi. Okay, it's successful and we are moving on. We just have to be patient. Alright, and there it is loading 20, 22% 100% Alright, so we're going to continue So we're going to name the camera office and then we'll, this password here you have to set it up for the camera assist for the IP camera 
right so you need to set up a secure password for your IP camera however we're going to skip that and then select country also alright so we're going to complete that alright let's see if it works so we're going to select the play button in the middle of the screen and there we go it's working alright so this is how you connect your um, IP camera using the Wi-Fi alright so we're going to um, use a network port this time around okay guys so we're back to the table so this is a dome camera and we're going to connect the camera using our network port here's a network port so we're going to put this network cable sorry this is a network cable this is a network port so we're going to connect the RG45 cable inside the network port and then we're going to connect our power, our 12 volt power and there's a light indicator. We're not going to use the Wi-Fi, we're going to use a network port to connect to the internet. Alright? Okay, so we are in the app again. And this time we're going to add the dome camera so we're going to select the plus sign up here on the right on right hand corner After the device powered on, we're not going to scan any qr code let me turn down this so we're not going to scan any qr code what we're going to do is down the bottom you will see other ways to add right other ways to add so we're going to select that down the bottom then we're going to select land scan land scan we're scanning the the local area network that's what land stand for the lan land stand for local air network However, as we can see, we see two camera, but we need to add the right camera. So we're gonna look at the the number, the ID number. So it's the top one, and we're gonna add that, then complete. We're waiting for it. Have to be patient. We said successful and here it is right there and we're gonna select play and that's it that's how it works all right so if we want to see both of the camera at the same time both of both camera at the same time we can go into group we have device and we have group at the top we're going to select group and we're going to add a group and we're going to add camera for the office and then add camera this camera down here we didn't name the camera we're going to select next we're going to say um call this um cameras cameras with a s and complete so select complete and one once we do that we can view the camera the two cameras at the same time all right just like that all right just like that okay i'll make this full screen and there we go Okay, that's it guys. Thanks for watching.